Do Science Me. <laughs> It's the I Can Do Science Me Open Auditions, where you get to answer your own big science questions under the ever-enthusiastic eye of Charlotte Hudson. If you've got a question, write to us at info at brainiac.co.uk and you too can have your moment in the science spotlight. Yes, hurry up, please. Number? I'm 23. Hello, yeah. Jessica Dawes of Bognor Regis. Hmm. Dear Brainiac, uh, I love the show, blah, 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 of course you do. Um, question. When I'm not squashing snails, I like to watch them sliming their way around the garden. I was wondering what surface do snails move on best? Cute. Well, we're all on tenter hooks with that one, Jessica. Better get on with it. This is the science you want done. We just give you the tools to do it. Carpet from Jessica's mum's hallway. Lino from Jessica's mum's kitchen. And a strip of grass from, yes, you guessed, Jessica's mum's front garden. Three surfaces you're likely to find snails wandering around on. Next, it's time for the main attraction. No, not her, the snails. You may be wondering why we're spraying them with water. Well, it's to keep the little beauties perky. They perform at their best when it's wet and humid, apparently. Add some cucumber at the opposite end, a snail's favourite treat, according to Jessica, and hopefully this experiment will be over quickly. Kids these days, aren't DVDs and computer games enough for them anymore? It's the parents I blame. Jessica says snails are belly-footed gastropods, which I guess means they use their belly as a foot and they're, well, gastropodic. Their slimy snot trail is a lubricant that lets them slide over rough surfaces without hurting themselves. Oh, and most of them are hermaphrodites. I suggest you ask mum or dad what that means. All I care about is how quickly they can motor. With an average speed of 4.8 metres per hour and about as much directional sense as a cheap sat-nav, this could take all day. Finally, after a fun-packed 22 minutes, we have a result. One turf snail has decided the grass is greener on the lino side and both carpet lane snails have defected clearly excited by the feel of plastic beneath their foot. Surely, five out of six snails can't be wrong. Uh, her name is Jessica Dawes. She wanted to know on what surface snails moved best. The answer, it would appear, is lino. Next. I can do science, me. 